a distal radius fracture is one of the most common injuries seen and we see more than 50 cases a month. You may know this injury as a broken wrist, but what exactly is a distal radius fracture and how do we treat it? Your forearm has two long bones in it, the ulna on the pinky side and the radius on the thumb side. The part of the radius bone closest to the wrist is called the distal radius. Fractures at the distal radius commonly occurs in two age groups. In younger patients, it occurs after high energy trauma, such as falling from height or from sports. In seniors, especially those with osteoporosis, it commonly occurs after a fall. The most common symptoms after a fracture are pain and swelling. Your wrist may also be bent in an unusual way. Less commonly, the nerves may be affected, which makes your hand or fingers feel numb. You will likely be seen by the emergency department following your injury. If the fracture fragments are significantly out of place, the emergency doctors will perform manipulation and reduction to move the fracture fragments into their correct position before putting your wrist in a back slab. You should keep your wrist elevated above your heart, either with an arm sling during the day or propped up on a pillow during sleep to reduce forearm swelling. You should have an appointment to see us within one to two weeks. We will repeat another x-ray to check the bone alignment. If the overall bone alignment is acceptable, the fracture can be treated conservatively with either a cast or a splint. If the bone fragments remain significantly out of place, you may require surgery. We will make an incision over the fracture site to realign the bone before securing it with plates, screws or pins. For both conservative and surgical treatment, recovery generally takes about 3 to 4 months. You will need to work closely with our hand occupational therapists to progressively regain your range of motion, strength and return to your daily activities and work. For more information, please talk to your doctor or visit our website.